It is the time of year when folks like to celebrate our nation's birthday by blowing things up. Most times fireworks, unfortunately, sometimes fingers. Master Detective Mike Lester of our Bomb and Arson Unit discusses some of the perils of celebrating the 4th of July. These are confiscated fireworks. Uh, we bring them to our range, uh, destroy them. Uh, this, is the, this is the method of destruction. Uh, they all go in their burn pile and uh, they're burned. Fireworks and bombs are really similar. They're both made out of the same chemical mixtures and uh, the, the fireworks are a little bit safer than a homemade bomb, but they're essentially the same thing. Consumer fireworks are all brightly packaged. They have instructions printed on them on how to use them and your professional fireworks or display fireworks are packaged usually in plain brown paper and they have no instructions on them with uh, different fusing systems on it. But like I said, uh, your, your typical consumer product has a uh, bright labels on it and gives you a warning on how to use it. If uh, they have regular consumer fireworks that they want to get rid of, they could take them to any division station and get rid of them. Uh, if they run across a professional firework or a display firework, uh, they need to call the police and we'll respond to, to remove it. Holiday season's here. Uh, be safe uh, and, and have fun this year, but like I said, be safe while we're using fireworks. Uh, in the Kansas City city limits, they're illegal. Uh, but uh, anywhere else in the metro, uh, have a fun, safe time. It is always a good idea to keep your pets inside during the periods of loud bangs. The Kansas City, Missouri Police Department encourages attending one of the many scheduled professional displays in the area. It's cheaper, it's safer, and most importantly, it's legal. I'm Officer Shelley Gaddis. Have a safe holiday.